The world has 280 million electric bikes and mopeds, and they cut the demand for oil far more than electric cars. Now, we don't see this here in the United States so much, but it's really popular throughout the third world. Close to half of all Australian commuter trips are by car, and in wealthier countries like the United States, 60% of car trips are less than 10 kilometers or about six miles. The best solution would be, you know, an EV, but for short trips, an electric bike or moped might be better for you. But what's amazing, this is kind of interesting, you would never see this here in the US. Like this picture here, they got three people on the electric scooter. I mean, that you would never see something like yeah, that you, here, here you in the pulled US. You get pulled over and uh, yeah, you, yeah, get, you, you get a ticket. Then, you yeah. get a ticket for that here in the US, right? And uh, on the world's roads, there were 20 million electric vehicles and 1.3 million commercial electric vehicles. That's a big number, too. I didn't realize there were that many electric buses, delivery vans, and trucks worldwide. That's starting to be a pretty that's big, big number. number. Yeah, that's a huge yeah. number. But there's 280 million electric mopeds, scooters, motorcycles, and three-wheelers last year on the road. And this cuts into oil by about a million barrels of oil a day, about 1% of the world's total oil demand. Uh, and it's interesting. It's having some some effect. Because yeah, those not- people have it, you know. You really don't need a car if you're only going to be going a couple miles here and there. And you know, we're, one thing we're privileged over here. Oh yeah, no doubt. Well, you know, one thing too. All oil demand isn't for burning it for fuel. A lot of it's for making roads and other things like that. A lot of uses for the oil that gets pumped out of the ground. But it's just that the majority use is as fuel. Um, but it's just hard to fathom, you know, could you imagine if we were in a country where everybody was riding around on electric bikes? I mean, it'd be hard to just see that. Hi, I'm David with EV World News. If you like this video, then please press the like button. If you like the content and would like to see more videos on electric vehicles, then please hit the subscribe button. If you have some feedback for us, please let us know in the comments. Have a great day.